Hello everyone, welcome back to Sydney and Starlet, and if you are new here, welcome, welcome, enjoy the videos. videos. So today me and Sydney are going to be reading a little golden book classic, Walt Disney's Three Little Pigs. So let's begin. Once upon a time, there were three little pigs who went out into the big world to build their homes and seek their fortunes. The first little pig did not like to work at all. He quickly built himself a house of straw. Then off he danced down the road to see how his brothers were getting along. And as he danced, he sang, I built my house of straw, I built my house of hay. I took my flute, I don't give a hoot, and play around all day. The second little pig was building himself a house too. He did not like work any better than his brother. So he had decided to build a quick and easy house of sticks. Soon it was finished too. It was not a very strong little house, but at least the work was done. Now the second little pig was free to do whatever he liked. <laughs> what he liked to do was play his fiddle and dance. So while the first little pig tooted his flute, the second little pig sawed away on his fiddle, dancing as he played. And he danced. And as he danced, he sang, I built my house of sticks, I built my house of twigs. With the hey diddle diddle, I play on my fellow and dance all kinds of jigs. <laughs> then off danced the two little pigs down the road together to see how their big brother was getting along. The third little pig was a sober little pig. He was building a house too, but he was building his of bricks. He did not mind hard work. He wanted a stout, little, strong, little house, for he knew that in the woods nearby, there lived a big, bad wolf who likes nothing better than to s catch little pigs and eat them up. So, slap, slash, slap, away he worked, laying bricks and smoothing mortar between them. Ha ha ha, laughed the first little pig when he saw his brother hard at work. Ha ha ha, laughed the second little pig. Come down and play with us, they called, he called. But the little pig did not pause. Slap, slop, slash, went the bricks on motor as he called down to them. I build my house of stones. I build my house of bricks. I have no chance to sing and dance for work and play do mix. Ha 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 laughed the two lazy little pigs dancing along to the tune of the fiddle and flute. You can laugh and dance and sing, their busy brother called after them. But I'll be safe and you'll be sorry when the wolf comes to the door. Ha 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 laughed the two little pigs again and they disappeared into the woods singing a merry tune. Who's afraid of a big bad wolf? The big bad wolf, the big bad wolf. Wolf, who's afraid of the big bad wolf? Tra la 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 la. Just as the first pig reached his door, out of the woods popped the big bad wolf. The little pig squealed with fright and slammed the door. Little pig, little pig, let me in, cried the wolf. Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin, said the little pig. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in, roared the wolf. And he did. He blew the little straw house all to pieces. Away raced the little pig to his brother's house of sticks. No sooner was he in the door. When a knock, 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 there was the big bad wolf. But of course, the little pigs would not let him come in. I'll fool those little pigs, chuckles the big bad wolf to himself. Then he said out loud, those little pigs are too smart for me. I'm going home. He started off towards the deep woods, but he did not go far. He hid behind a big tree. Soon, the door opened and the two little pigs peeked out. There was no wolf in sight. <coughs> wow, bless you. <laughs> Ha ha ha! Ho ho ho! laughed the two little pigs. We fooled him! Then they danced around the room, singing gaily. Who's afraid of the big bad wolf? The big bad wolf? The big bad wolf? Who's afraid of the big bad wolf? Tra la 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 la! 
Soon, there came another knock at the door. It was the big bad wolf again, but he had covered himself with sheepskin, and he curled up in a big basket, looking like a little lamb. Who's there? called the second little pig. I'm a poor little sheep with no place to sleep. Please open the door and let me in, said the big bad wolf in a sweet little voice. The little pig peeked through a crack of the door, and they could see the wolf's big black paws and sharp fangs. Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. You can't fool us with that sheepskin, said the second pig. Then I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in, cried the angry old wolf. So he huffed and he puffed and he puffed and he huffed and he blew the little twig house all to pieces. Away raced the two little pigs straight to the third little pig's house of bricks. Don't worry, said the third little pig to his two frightened little brothers. You are safe here. Soon they were all singing gaily. This made the big bad wolf perfectly furious. Now by the hair of my chinny chin chin he roared. I'll puff and oh, I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house in. So the big bad wolf huffed and he puffed and he puffed and he huffed, but he could not blow down that little house of bricks. How could he get in? At last, he thought of the chimney. So up he climbed quietly. Then, with the snarl, down he jumped right into a kettle of boiling water. With a yelp of pain, he sprang straight up the chimney again and raced away from that house as fast as he could go. The three little pigs spent their time in the strong little brick house, singing and dancing merrily, and the big bad wolf never came back again. The is the end. So that is it for today, everyone. Really hope you all enjoyed it, and we'll see you all next time. Bye bye. Bye bye. Pick out your favorite page. Who's your favorite character? Bank. Very good choice. Bye bye. Bank. Pig. <laughs>